Hey, good morning. Um, I wanted to say hello to the new subscribers. I've suddenly had a load more subscribers on YouTube and it's amazing. Thank you. I haven't posted anything on there for a bit. I've had so much stuff going on. Um, so this isn't a demonstration of anything. It's just a bit of a show and tell. Now, one of my videos has had thousands of views. Amazing. Um, and I think by now, those of you who subscribe to me will know that I'm a bit obsessed with wrapping cloths. And wrapping cloths, to me, are pieces of stitched fabric, big, like, throws, like blankets, like coverlets. But to me, there's something I use, metaphorically, to protect my children, to wrap my children in and protect them. And then my children aren't children anymore, but if you're a mother, you know that you're going to protect your kids forever even if they're 95, which mine aren't 95, by the way, because that'd make me over 100. And if I'm like this when I'm over 100, I'll be happy. Anyway, so, I've got, <coughs> excuse me, I've got a bit of a class going on at the minute. It's nearly finished, an online class. It's nearly finished, but what I've been doing in there, amongst other things, I have a box, like, well, I have boxes everywhere, and I have a cabinet behind me, and there's just loads of samples, and I thought, let's just put these to some use in the class. Can you see it's just round restitched samples, um, all different kinds of backgrounds, all different kinds of fabrics, um, different techniques. Um, so I'm starting to put them together, not all of them, some of them won't go in this piece. Um, starting to put together another wrapping cloth in that class. Can you see there's just masses and masses of stitched samples. Um, some of them are on paper, I won't be using them in this. Some of them are just little ideas that never came to anything, but they're still valid samples. Um, so yeah, so that's what we've been doing in class, partly been doing, we haven't just been doing that. Um, so I'll just put these away and I'll show you. So I've got some uh, samples out of here. And I'll show you what I've come up with up to now with the wrapping cloth for class. This is paper. Um, So many, many samples. I've got these everywhere. Um, I could probably make enough wrapping cloths to keep the whole world going with all the stitch samples I've got lying around. Right, so that's that. I think that's all from, right, I'm gonna keep that one out actually. And that's paper as well. Right, so if I move this box and then get this thing. So initially what I did in class was piece a panel for a wrapping cloth which is this bit okay and then because of time pressure very often in class I don't make as much progress as the, the people in the class because I have to think of the next thing before I can finish the first thing and um, so basically they move ahead quicker than me so that was the first panel that I pieced it's not finished and then out of that box none of this matches okay out of that box I got these so this one okay and you'd think that's not going to go with that caramel. Well, it probably isn't, but it doesn't matter because this isn't for sale. It's not for anyone else. It's just for me and I don't mind. Um, and then this one, which doesn't go with that one. And it doesn't go with that one. But to me, again, that doesn't matter to me. Um, so what I've added here so far, so that's the one I pieced originally. That's out of the box. That's out of the box. So basically all I've done so far with this is added prairie points on that seam when I join that. Now that doesn't match with anything either. None of those fabrics are present in this work. It doesn't matter. I don't mind. My mission is to teach my group how to progress the work, how to think out of the box. Um, about cohesion, yes, which there isn't much of on here, but we talk about that. Um, and as I progress with this, I can bring these fabrics in, okay? So that's not a problem. So this is what I've been doing. I've been teaching, oh, and we've got a pocket in here as well. We did this last time. There's a little pocket in there, can you see? Um, so that's basically where I'm up to. So my class is nearly finished. Um, then I'm having some house renovations done, starting a week on Monday. And I uh, don't know if you'll get any videos then either, but I will do my best. I could maybe try and make some before it starts and post them as we go along. But I just want to keep my subscribers interested because I'm so grateful to you for being here. Okay, um, so that's it. Just a little show and tell. Uh, have a lovely weekend.